In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to change the default settings in Adobe Acrobat 2025. Whether you use Adobe Acrobat for work, study, or creative projects, customizing the default settings can greatly enhance your experience and productivity. Adobe Acrobat offers a variety of settings you can adjust to suit your personal preferences, and today we're going to walk through a simple process to change them. We'll start by opening up your Adobe Acrobat. Once you've launched the application, take a look towards the top left corner where you will see the menu button. Go ahead and click on that. This button is your gateway to all the options and settings Adobe Acrobat has to offer. Once the menu opens, the next step is to find and select the preferences option. This is where you can dive into the specifics and really tailor the software to your individual needs. Now, with the preferences window open, you'll notice a variety of categories listed, each representing different settings you can modify. Don't feel overwhelmed by the options, think about what aspects of the application you use the most and how you might want to change them. For today's tutorial, we're going to focus on modifying the page display settings. But remember, the process we're discussing can be applied to other categories in the preferences menu too. So for our example, click on page display from the list of categories you see on the left. This section lets you control how your documents are presented when you open them. It might seem like a small detail, but having a comfortable and consistent viewing setup can make your workflow much more efficient and enjoyable. Once you've selected page display, direct your attention to the right part of the window. Here you'll find the default layout and zoom settings. You can adjust these to your liking by selecting from various page layouts and zoom levels. Whether you prefer single page view, facing or continuous, this choice is yours. Similarly, select the zoom level that suits your vision best, whether it's fit to width or fit to page. Uh, make sure it feels just right for you. After you've made your selections, it's important to save these changes so Adobe remembers your preferences for future use. Simply click the OK button at the bottom of the preferences window. This action applies your new settings and from now on, whenever you open a document, it will display according to your new preferences. That wraps up today's lesson on changing default settings in Adobe Acrobat 2024. Uh, save, see. By following these simple steps, you can adjust the application to better meet your needs, making each task a bit smoother. Don't hesitate to explore other settings categories and fine tune the application to your liking. Thanks for watching, and if you found this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe for more tech tips.